What's up guys, Tyler Casey here, and today I'm gonna to show you how to use our free smoke effects pack in Final Cut Pro X. This is a completely free pack, there's no paid version, and it's super easy to use in Final Cut. You just drag it and drop it right in, and you get some nice smoke overlays. So I'm gonna show you guys how to download it off our website, and then some tips and tricks on how to use it in Final Cut. So let's get started. To get our free packs, just head on over to cinepacks.com, and you're gonna wanna come right here to free packs. Here you can download any of our free packs, but today I'm gonna scroll all the way down and I'm gonna get smoke effects right here. This is a full free pack, so there's no paid version of this pack. Everything is free. You can see some of the smoke effects right here. And what we're gonna wanna do is we're gonna wanna click buy it now. If you wanna add more free packs to your cart, feel free to click add to cart and add all the free packs you'd like. Once you're right here, I'm gonna go ahead and type in my email. We need your email because we're gonna email you over the download link. Right here, make sure to put in your name and last name, but when it comes to your address, you can just fill this in with random information. We don't really need this. Shopify just makes us put this there. And then make sure to just type in any zip code. I think it has to be in the correct state. So I'm gonna type in a zip code and now click pay now. So once you click pay now, it's gonna process your order. You're gonna get an email and then it should prepare your downloads right here. If this takes a while, make sure to check your email and we'll send you a download link once it's ready. So you can see, you can just download it right here. It's 4.3 gigabytes. So you wanna make sure you don't have anything else running in the background and it's gonna start downloading right here. Once I have the pack downloaded, I'm gonna go ahead and open up and I just clicked it and it started unzipping the file. So this is what comes in the pack. This is a tutorial. This is probably how you got here. Uh, if you wanna see all our tutorials, you can go to this link right here. Uh, and then this is all the smoke effects. So we can just play a few of these. Uh, they're all QuickTime files. They're all 2K quality. We made them 2K resolution so we could fit a bunch of them in here. So you can see there's all different types. There's colored ones. There's uh, just the regular like gray smoke effects. Um, so what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna grab all these and I'm just gonna bring them into Final Cut. So let's say I just want this simple one overlaying on this clip right here. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag this in. Let's play that through. Let's see what happens there. It's just a puff of smoke. And we can see it right there. Perfect. So what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to come over to here. And I'm going to change the blending mode to either add or screen. I'm going to try add. And let's play that through and see how it looks. We get a puff of smoke over right in front of him. So it's pretty nice for this scene because we do have smoke going on in the background. But it adds some nice texture in front of him. So let's try something else a little bit longer. Let's check this one out. So we could grab this clip right here and same thing. We're gonna wanna change that blending mode to add. And then when we play that through, we get this nice like smoldering smoke. We got smoke rings coming up. And one cool thing, I'm gonna delete that top layer. And one cool thing we can do as well is we can actually play with the color of this. You can also play with the speed as well. But if we click color right here, we can actually play around with the color. You wanna grab this right here and you can really select any color that you want. So. You can come down here and make it green and then you can even play with the saturation and you can make it more saturated as well. I think this looks really cool and it's a cool way to play around with it, especially if we have the colored smoke. This kind of gives like that breaking bad, like almost like Halloween type vibe, super cool look to it. And let's say we think it's a little bit too much. We can always draw a mask on it as well. You can also play around with the scale and rotation. So let me grab another piece of smoke. Let's check this one out. So let's play this one through. Let's say I want this one on there, but let's say, let's change it to add and let's play around with the scale and rotation on this. So let's see where it's at right there. Let's say I want it. Let's actually go back to normal real quick and let's make it a little bit bigger. So we're gonna play with the scale and let's say we wanna move the position around a little bit. Let's say, let's see how that looks. Yeah, I want it more on the bottom on this one. So I think that looks good, but let's say I don't want it going up past his face. So what we can also do is I'm going to change this back to add, and then we're gonna come down to effects and we're actually gonna grab the draw mask tool uh, under effects. So I'm gonna drag that on. And then if you just hit B on the keyboard, we should be able to draw a quick little mask. So I kind of want it to chop off like right around his head. And you can do this with any of them. You can rotate them and you can draw a nice mask. And then the key is you also want to feather it quite a bit. So I'm going to just drag this out and then I'm going to feather it quite a bit. So let's play that through and see if it looks noticeable. So we see the smoke on the bottom and it doesn't cover his whole face. 
Whereas let's say we don't have that on, we would see that it's coming up all the way over the top. It's a completely free pack. So go through, try out all these. You can stack them, you can layer them, you can track them into your scene. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like. Make sure to subscribe for more tutorials, whether that's on Final Cut or Premiere. We're dropping tutorials for all our editing packs on this channel. We're giving away a bunch more free packs. So make sure to subscribe, hit that bell notification so you're notified the next time we drop a video here on Cinepacks. Thank you guys for watching. I'll catch you guys next time.